This is a full face of luxury makeup. And this filter picks what I do for each step. I'm doing this really pretty everyday golden look. The scent of the Chanel foundation is making me so fucking lightheaded, bro. I gotta get water. Oh, I'm gonna truck through this, dude. Give me an eyeliner, please. I have these liquid liners from Dior. They're green. They have like a metallic finish. What do you say we try it? If it ends up being a bad idea, we scrap it and go over it with black. Honestly, I'm kind of into it. Okay, I need a good mascara. I'm gonna add some lashes. YSL. Not a fan of this mascara, but we have to play by the rules, okay? You gotta curl your lashes. And for falsies, I'm using Lily Lashes Miami Light. The eyes are a bit simple for my taste, but I really like them. I want to do a killer lip combo, so let's start with lip liner. Chanel. Oh god, I'm gonna have to dig for that. I got like one. And then how about lipstick? Something really, really pretty. Giorgio Armani. Okay. Time to dive into the sea to find the hidden Chanel lip liner. One hour later, and I have it. Imagine this lip combo looks like shit. This is Chanel Nude Burn Lip Liner. So far, I actually do like this color. These are the Giorgio Armani Lip Power Lipsticks. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> I'm going to try a different color. This is shade 203. <sighs> Just accept it. How's about a really good setting spray to finish this beautiful look off, Chanel? I'd rather die than spray a Chanel setting spray on my face. I don't even know if they have one. All right, one more try. If I have it, I'll use it. You fuck, fuck you. <laughs> you know what? I'm just gonna go no setting spray. The look is very fall. Most luxury makeup does actually slay, but you can obviously get the same results with drugstore and affordable products. Who doesn't love a good luxury makeup moment, though?